Loose down into the skates of the Warrior defender. Delay will, link, will play it back off the boards and a shot from the line by Morse goes wide. In from the blue line on the left wing side is Weeb. Down below the goal line, a centering pass in front. Great stop by Katz with the left pad as he came out to Rob Delay who went to the front of the goal. Tried to delay the goal center on the blocker's side but... Landon Hilda, so we're back to five on five, and Abram Weaver, the shot from the blue line, went off the end boards. Is that Karen back along to the right side? But Devlin is there for the take. Put it up the wall, trying to work this out is Chris Duclair. Hilda's trying to do the same, but now it's Chilliwack onto it, and they score. Just 48 seconds into the second period. West Kelowna can't clear after the penalty kill comes to an end. And it's Brian Morris from the right wing side who walks in with a heavy shot from the high slot and beats Katz on the glove side. Third goal of the year for Morris and Chilliwack's open the scoring and they lead at 1-0. Makes a couple of moves to get into the offensive zone. Midpoint, Abram Weeb, right wing side. Gets it back again, AJ Lacroix, left wing. Castle ring back for Lacroix, they score! <laughs> AJ Lacroix on a one-timer from the right face-off circle. Beats Katz on the blocker side on the four-on-three power play. So Chilliwack converts, and if you're West Kelowna, you just can't keep taking these penalties. It's the fifth time you've allowed the Chiefs to go to the penalty to the power play, and the penalty kill has been great up to this point. But you're playing with fire at that rate, and then Porchetta got up, defended himself, and I don't know if what Porchetta did really deserved a penalty, but nonetheless, we'll play four on four, and here's Chilliwack back, and again a centering pass, they score. Dylan Kinch down low, centered it, and it was Brady Milburn that finishes it off on the glove side. Eight seconds into four on four. Chilliwack's made it three to nothing. Try to get that puck back out through the center, and it was knocked down by Miles, who put it back out through the neutral zone and flung back in now by Abram Weeb. Zenia Miles reverses it around. Reeves back with a behind the goal with 1.15 to go here in the third. Reeves drops it off. Jake Bernadette will start ahead. Bernadette down the left wing side. Cuts to the high slot. He scores! Jake Bernadette with 1.04 to go here in the third. Able to get in across the blue line. Cut to the high slot and wheels a shot past the blocker side of Austin McNicholas. And it breaks the shutout bid for McNicholas with that goal. It makes it a 3-1 game with 104 to go in the third. Bernadette just came through the middle with speed. Cut in across the blue line in the high slot. Let that shot go and it eludes McNicholas past the blocker's side.